Mike here bringing you episode 3 of my Plot Bin Rogues Korea Season 2 guys if you've missed Season 1 check out the sub bar because uh, I did quite a lot of writing there uh, just to uh, tell you if you're new to my channel um, just a few stuff around the background why I started it uh, the, the uh, game uh, settings and that like the difficulty and pitch stuff and all that so we got quite an easy game today actually guys coming off our Newcastle win beating them 4-0 um, we got quite an easy game Middlesbrough today the newly promoted obviously uh, so they got promoted this season and it, hopefully I don't want to underestimate them but hopefully it can be a really easy game and um, I'm just hoping that we can uh, continue on the winning streak that we started off with a, a great win against uh, Tottenham Oxford is the 3-1 victory and um, the great win against uh, Newcastle. Obviously a tough side to go to at uh, St. James's Park as well. And um, it's a great win as well. We a great goal difference for us at the moment. I think it's a six goal difference or something like that. You see at the table anyway, all depending on the final score on this. Um, so if I sound a bit uh, low today guys, uh, got a bit of tons of lights in the development of uh, this video and I'm not going to get rid of it so I don't really want it and it's starting to brew up so I am taking some tablets so don't worry guys just post in the comments get well soon uh, it don't matter just post it um, rate comment subscribe this video rate comment subscribe the video rate comment favorite this video um, every little helps and um, it, it is all much appreciated I did actually put that in the description um, so we got someone new on today we have got several changes as well today and Speaking of that, we got Griffiths getting the first goal of the game, and uh, five minutes in a great start for Blackburn Rovers. Um, so we got a few changes today, and one of our new signings playing as well today. Um, we set with the four one two and two, um, but we have brought David Dunn on. Uh, the reason for that, I think, I still got Pearson playing. Or yeah, I got Pearson, but he's playing on the wing. Um, for the reason now is, is that I wanted to give uh, who is it, Al Hajj do uh, rest. And uh, for the, I think we got, we have got a few European games coming up as well. Uh, so that should be exciting because you get to see me play against all the bigger teams to see me uh, uh, challenge and then see the real football really come into the game. So, for example, I think one of the games is against uh, Atletico Madrid, and then we got, I think we got a group is like Atletico Madrid, Juventus, uh, PSV, and I'm not percent I think it's worth the Bremen, and not percent So, it's obviously going to be a exciting one. Oh, so we need um, I get a tough game against Juventus and Atletico Madrid, and maybe the other game should be quite easy, especially for the ability but here we go lovely football and simple as you like Griffith slots it in um, he did a very similar one against Newcastle a goal like that um, we have got Robert Untrell playing for us today he, uh, any of you who don't know who he is he plays for Nottingham Forest and um, I decided about him because um, he's obviously getting on in life and uh, he's a really fast player and I thought oh, I'll bring him in he's only a little cheap he's cheap as well and I want this uh, another replacement striker for um, Oh, I can't remember the other one was. I think it was Ben Johnny as well because I forgot to renew his contract. For some reason, a couple of people, uh, it was Tim Howard, uh, Pedro and Ben Johnny, only won one year contracts and I completely forgot to renew them. So I'm fortunate they did not have him, especially after his recent performance against Li Li Erla. <laughs> his recent performance against Liverpool. Um, obviously, when I'm recording this, was the night after the Liverpool game, which brought me 1 3 when a great goal was by Ben Johnny. Second one slightly easy as you like, but the first one was brilliant. Um, but uh, any Liverpool fans, uh, I love it when uh, people post in the comments and they say hey, it's not a real life score. Like, there was a Liverpool game where people like 3 uh, 2 1, something like that, and uh, <laughs> someone called posting comment, hey, 1 0 in real life. I just want to call me about 83 one in real life. <laughs> it's funny, man. Um, so, uh, oh, here we go. We got Pedro charging on the wing, a little bulldog. Uh, again, trying to get knocked off the ball, but, ooh, putting in a poor cross at the end of it. I think it is coming up to half time now. Yeah, it is half time. And, uh, great lead to actually go in with 2 0. Did expect more. I can't if I put. I think we could, I had a few more chances and we could have uh, easily got 3 or 4. Uh, but uh, hey, you don't want to ask for too much. Two goals is good enough to go into half time with. When we get Middlesbrough actually kicking off the second half now. Uh, 
Yep, they are kicking off second half. So, great start for Blackburn Rovers. Uh, yeah, but here we go. He could be even better. Robert Earnshaw with the ball charging down the wing. Again, not with the ball. Uh, still back into it. Squares it to Griffiths. And Griffiths hit the first time. What a curve on that ball that was. Uh, if, you, if you guys didn't notice, actually watch that again. Because that was a great curve. I can't if they actually show it from a different angle. Like the low angle. And you can actually see the bend on it first time as well. Uh, unfortunately, don't. But it would have been great if they actually did, because the um, sort of ball on it is the first time the curve. And um, I remember, I think I went into instant replay and actually watched it. The curve was uh, brilliant. Griffiths is uh, one of the best strikers that I've ever. I know he's my creative player, but usually you get like, oh yeah, Drop is the best striker. But um, Griffiths at the moment has been one of the best. He got the pace. He got the height. He got decent head in. And Robert Earnshaw, his first game of the season, well, started first game of the season, uh, getting a buck in there. But mm, maybe a bit of a rage guy, you never know. But here we go. Who was that? 90%. But we got. Can't actually read the name. Highlight on the board there. Fair sorry, that. I was in charging down. But what the hell was that by Middlesbrough? And then they're trying to get through on goal now. But we got we got there. Nelson with the ball, but they couldn't come out on top. Samba as well. He's been pushing forward. And he's been a great like uh, kind of CDM slash striker slash defender. Um, he's been playing awesome lately. Uh, for me, if any of you in your manager mode, I would advise you about him. But Pedersen, I go for the shot. Yeah, I don't even know why, but we do come up with a penalty. And um, well, <laughs> and uh, even Middlesbrough beats for me. But um, uh, and I don't know why I actually went for the shot. You know when you feel ambitious and um, you're like, oh yeah, I think I can score from there. You got the position in, and you're like, yeah. But then you don't. But then you do come off and get the um, apparently. But I think I do actually uh, pick Pearson to take this. Usually I would pick Griffiths. So you go 88 uh, penalties. But I think, oh, I'll give it, give it a pass and see when he actually earned a penalty. But here we go, can we actually score it with the gamble? We do a very close penalty. The people almost get into it. Making it, is it 4 0 now? Yes, 4 0 the Blackburn Rovers. And, um, well, it should be a great finish for Blackburn Rovers. Maybe to get one or two, maybe another one into the. Uh, the other picture now before it ends, but um, it looks like we finished beating them 4 0, guys. And um, a great win for Blackburn Rovers, a great win for me as well in the league. And um, hopefully, you guys enjoyed that as much as I did. And um, I will, I did bring Karen in it, Sean. I forgot to mention that. I didn't put it in the video for some reason, but I will see you guys in my next video. Uh, don't forget to check out my Twitter date, guys, because that's where you usually find all my updates. For example, some late minute change, you usually find it on there. So um, that's what I was trying to see. All the links are in the sub. Check my website as well, because if you click on the ads as well, I earn money and um, I can bet get your games. Because I've had a few people saying, Oh, why, why don't you do this game? And I'm like, I got no money to actually buy the game. So if you do that, I get some money and it's free of charge for you. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.